homeless man with upper left quadrant pain. The only physician that eases his pain is a fetal physician. He's also nauseous and he came in with a blood alcohol level of 0.15. Yeah, Captain Morgan's got himself a case of acute pancreatitis. You know that without assessing him? Maybe we should... Maybe you should go get a serum amylase test. This guy's enzymes in his pancreas are activating way earlier than they should be. His pancreas is literally eating itself from the inside out. Man, I'm hungry. All right, so if this test shows he has acute pancreatitis, you want me to make him MPO and put him on 125 cc's of lactated ringers? Yeah, that's right. The important thing right now is to make sure that his pancreas rests. Why don't you give him some Demerol for the pain and give him some Protonics to help that nausea out. All and, right. And, by the way, the test will turn out positive. But you may want to do a serum amylase and a CT scan or something just for the paperwork's sake. All right. By the way, Dr. Holmes, this is Susie. She's a nursing student who's going to be working with us today. Hmm. Santa Claus called. He wants his suit back. Oh, well, it's nice to meet you, too. <laughs> What happened to your leg? <laughs> Looks painful. I heard it beating up a nursing student that asked too many questions. Well, I'm off. Don't worry about him. Why don't you go in, get this patient's vital signs, do a quick assessment, and I'll come and check on you in a little bit. Okay? okay. I think you can do this. drinking last night. Were you at Kilroy's? I was there. I didn't see you. Drinking? Me? I do not drink. Um, I was at Grandma's last night, so, you know. Oh, my bad. Oops. Well, you have pancreatitis. Yes. Pancreatitis. Pain! That's right, you should be in pain. That's what my last med surge test told me. So, you're hurting? Yeah, a lot. before we do this if I, you know, have a little something to smoke, you know, I'm really jonesing for a cigarette. What do you say? Uh, Here, Jason, soon you understand. No, I mean, yes, I mean, my... <coughs> asthma! Asthma! Ooh, you don't look so good. Nurse! <laughs> nurse! <laughs> What's going on in here? <laughs> Susie, do you have asthma? Oh, I can't breathe. Oh, where's your rescue inhaler? <coughs> Dr. Holm, will you get her rescue inhaler? I'll stay with her. <coughs> they do say that there is no I in team, but there's a you and nurse. You go get it. Okay, Susie, take some deep breaths. He's gonna have your rescue inhaler. Here there we go. go. Let's shake it up. Crippled. Okay, push down. Take a deep breath. Hold for ten seconds. Blow it out. Okay. <laughs> it should be fast acting. Let's try, do it one more time. Big breath. Hold for ten seconds. All right. Are you smoking? <laughs> oh, sorry. No. I don't know what you're talking about. Do you realize about. that cigarette smoke caused her asthma attack? <coughs> oh, my bad. Maybe I should get out of here. <laughs> okay, Susie. Let's sit. Let's have a seat. <coughs> Let's check your she that. Keep taking some big, deep breaths. I make the order. Can we get her on two liters? Two liters would be great. Okay. Are you feeling
feeling any better? It's on my way. <sighs> a little bit. All right. Do you know any triggers that cause your asthma attack? No, I mean, the smoking, I guess. All right. <coughs> Other triggers can be anything like allergens such as dust and mold and pet dander. Anything like cold air. Do you use your peak flow meter? Uh, sometimes. I mean, I used it this morning. I was in the yellow zone. Yellow for sunshine? Sunshine? Not very often, though. Just this morning, I guess. <laughs> no. <clears throat> yellow means you're at, you're between 50 and 80 percent of your best peak flow rate. And it's very dangerous. Listen, sister. They make this bed as simple as possible. Red is like the stoplight. Stop. It's important and it's bad. What you need to do right away is you need to get to a doctor. But don't ever come crawling to my office. Okay, well, <laughs> I'm still having uh, difficulty breathing. <laughs> Keep taking big, deep breaths. Um, are you on any other asthma medications? Yeah, I'm on an inhaler, like, oh. Albuterol? Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. That's your rescue inhaler that we just took. Oh. Do you have any others? Well, we need to contact your doctor, and he can set you up on a medication schedule to control your asthma. Okay. You're going to listen to your own sounds now. Big breath. So what do you think? Maybe uh, putting that girl on a corticosteroid or something? Yeah, maybe something like Pomacort. That should work well with her uh, rescue inhaler. I tell you, this girl's in a load of trouble. Oh, jeez. Women.